we say this is the season to believe, and for many it is. They believe in whether it be Santa or whether it be the or whether it be just the miracle of Christmas, and some don't even know what to believe in. But the Bible makes it clear that today is the second time, and the Bible says, Today, if you hear his voice, do not harden your hearts, for today is the day of salvation. Jesus said, Repent and believe the gospel. If you're at your wit's in or you don't know where to turn, a lot of people believe in so many different things. People ask, why should I believe in Christ? Because Christ has forgave us from our sins. And even in Christian, uh, even being a Christian, it is really hard to, it is really hard to, um, it's still, life is still a struggle. We so uh, seek the identity of others instead of what God would have us to see. Jesus said, Rejoice not that your reward, that demons are subject to you, but that your reward is in heaven. So many times we look to the temporal circumstances, and just like the disciples, we have wanted the temporal fix. But we need to rejoice that He has saved us from our sins. We so long for a lifestyle instead of having life itself. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life, and no man comes to the Father but by me. This Christmas time, and as you see the tree behind me, let it serve as a reminder, the star that points to the day star. The Bible says, let the day star arise in your hearts. And and that we would see that beyond the tree is much more is that the Bible says that Jesus had died on a tree. It said, Cursed is the man that was died on the tree. He died and bore our sins, whether we have told just a, a lie or no matter how small we think we have sinned, God sees it as a big deal and he has made a way for escape. The alternative is that we spend eternity in hell because we have broken God's just law and we need to repent and trust in Him. If you don't know Christ as your Lord and Savior, feel free to uh, click on the link below and make sure you mention that you have heard this from Tis the Season. So as you we would like you to make this the season of belief, to start your belief for Christ today. As we, it is not easy being a, it is not easy being a Christian. But one thing is for certain that when life gets rough and bumpy, we don't rejoice on the temporal things, but on the eternal things. We don't know when Christmas was established as a holiday, but we, we do know is that it was celebrated by early Christians and they chose December. And even where some may argue that it was a pagan holiday, it is a time of reflection, a time of year's end where we remember. And it's so apropos that it's a winter season when we remember the Bible says, Remember the Creator in the days of your youth, lest the evil days come and you, f um, and you forget your Creator. And we are to remember the Creator in the days of our youth.